Hello everyone, Mike Stokes with Lush Planet Design Build and today I want to show you our latest reclaimed, repurposed build, our sunroom that we built for $250 and all reclaimed material, old sliding glass doors and old redwood decking. So the first thing that I'd like to show you are these pieces of wood. So these, all these pieces of wood are uh, old 2x6 redwood decking and what I did was I just cut off the bad parts um, so there was about an inch of rot on one side and I cut them all off and all of these that you see go around so I, I made it three inches wide and the reason that I made them three inches wide was because I wanted to use a header which is the old 2x6 decking just basically scabbed together pieces. I used two of them nailed together and so that's exactly three inches wide. So I, cut, I ripped down the rest of the wall to meet that same width. So on to these glass panes. So these are from old aluminum sliding glass doors. And so basically what I did was I took it, these pieces, once I cut them down to three inches wide, and I stuck them through my table saw with a half inch, with the blade about a half inch up, and ran them through several times. You could do it with a dado blade, but since I didn't want to change out my dado blade, I just ran them with the blade sort of off center a few times and ran them through a couple of times. If you want to see that, you can watch my time lapse video, and it basically just shows me running the boards through the table saw. So all of these, one of the things that's important about this is that the glass is about a quarter inch in and it has about a quarter inch, well not a quarter inch, about an eighth inch on each side so that when the water, when the wood swells with the water, the glass won't be pinched or at least knock on wood, that's the theory. Uh, this has about a three quarter inch gap on the top so that the, the wood can expand and contract and the glass can move around. So when I put these in, they were, um, they'd rattle a lot as you push on them. Now they don't because I have caulked a clear caulk. I like the Lexol caulk and I caulked all the way around here um, to seal it from the weather. So I just wanted to show you the old panes. So this is example of one of the panes. I've been harvesting these for several years just off of job sites. I knew I wanted to use them at some point and so this is the project that they came into use. So if you look here you'll see just a little screw, a large Phillips head screw. There's another one down here. Basically just pull them out on each end and then this piece rips off and then I just bang that out and then you have a nice tempered piece of glass. Old deck pieces which we just turned into rafters. I had some old uh, hangers laying around and then these cross members that I have right here these were just scraps and you know they don't need to be two by six so I cut them down to half width and that worked fine. The only so this project like I said cost $250 um, and that was basically just the I got the the highest quality fiberglass clear roofing that I could get and the little wiggle board um, you can't you have to do the wiggle board or it or won't really attach right but the rest of it all reclaimed material um, I chose to screw this all together so it's just basically everything screwed together you could nail it together it doesn't really matter um, you might see these little pieces of a uh, little bit of rot here and there but this this is going to be fine um, when it's on a deck and there's a lot of wood to wood contact and a lot of moisture that stays on it then it would rot really bad but now that it's up and there's air all around it it's going to last for many many years probably uh, probably a lot longer than I'll even want it um, so I think that's it and uh, if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comments section uh, subscribe to the channel below uh, or watch more of our videos and have a great day. Thanks for watching.